How's it going everybody? Uh, this video is kind of a two type deal. It's me trying to change out the carburetor in this thing. I bought a brand new one. I'm going to switch it out. Not as easy as my old lawnmower. My old lawnmower was right on the side. A couple bolts. Change out the hoses. Use this business. This thing you've got to take all apart to get to the carburetor which is right here. You gotta take all of this off. Like you see, I already took the uh, the, the air filter off. Um, this is either gonna be a complete disaster, or I'm gonna be really proud of myself. Because uh, my mechanic skills are, yeah, I got a little bit of skills, but they're not where they should be. But uh, let's get started. Oh, also, this video will help myself because if I take a break in between to go to the gym or to go do whatever. I can look back on the video and see what I took off, how I took it off, and kind of reverse engineer getting it back on when it's time to get it back on. So, now let's get started. Okay, here it is. I guess I gotta take off this pump. I think it's dirty. Oh, I'm about to drain this gas too. But I thought of that. It'll be next, I think. I'm just gonna do a couple of these bolts. There's only two bolts. First thing is to drain this gas out. And that is, it barely reaches, but it reaches. Got a little gas on my hand. Here, I have to get those with a wrench. Let's see. I don't know. I don't think my socket's going to fit. There we go. Just do the righty tidy, lefty loosey. In my head there for a second. Doing it all backwards like this. Two bolts in here. That's all I gotta do. Tell y'all my mechanic skills wasn't greatest, but I, I, I try to get it done. Got that screw. And that one. Ta da! It's the carburetor that we're trying to change out. Oof. 
take this off and put it back on. Yes. overcome. The linkage chain that goes on there. So I think you gotta take these pieces off first. Get to that. This seems like a good stopping point for now. Go to the gym. Come back with this after I got my pump on. Or maybe even this evening. We'll see. There it goes. I might need that one at least. So these little doodads right here, I gotta, well, I gotta take this one off here, I think, first. Oh, yeah, there it goes, it's loosening up. Fingers in there, good thing I got tiny fingers. Oh, still. find that boat or remind me that goes one. Oh, okay. I think it came, yeah, it came right off. Okay. The one on this side came off. Oh, now I can unhook this one. Ah, all right. There we go. So let's, let's let that, we'll take these off here. Now I should be able to get them. Oh, man, that's still, still tricky to get them off of there. 
Okay. It's one. Turn this one. Okay. There they go. The two throttle cables. Now I gotta take this body off somehow. It's got some these weird screws. There we go. Cooking with some grease now. What? Oh, here it goes. Just gotta use a little bit of force, apparently. Okay, we can clean all this up. Alright, let's get this thing kind of cleaned up. Don't gotta be too clean, just gotta be enough. Get some of that crow do off of there. Put that over there. Okay. So it's rubber, metal, rubber however you want to call it so I don't know oh I bet it's for some of them it's probably this piece but this one is this piece so you go like this yeah I see now This piece goes on here. That makes sense. Did both of them go in there? Couldn't hurt, I wouldn't imagine. Oh, getting those pieces back on there gonna be gonna be fun fun. kind of hold it in place. I have to go back and watch the video to see how I did this. <laughs> uh, that don't want to go. Oh, wait. Oh, felt like it went. Uh,
All right. Let's see what happens. All right, so I have to get a new battery for this thing. Let's see if we can get it cranked up. Stuff that'll drive you to drinking. So as y'all saw so far in the video, I think I'm gonna make me a drink here in a little bit. <laughs> I got the lawnmower started, but it would only run for about 10 to 15 seconds and then kill. And I ended up running the battery dead doing that. Well, today I put I put the lawnmower up for the day. Said the heck with it, it was getting dark. So today. After I went to the gym, brought Mason to get a haircut, made some breakfast burritos. That's going to be a video I have to do, but we'll talk about that later. I uh, put the charger on the thing. Well, my old boat, beat up boat charger, not boat charger, uh, portable charger that I had, apparently finally crapped out. It's a charger that I got from my dad back in the day. And I've been having it since like 03 or 04. So it's probably 30 years old. And it's only putting out 12.2 volts so I improvised see if y'all can see well, let's flip let's flip the camera around not this battery I just moved it this is the lawnmower battery see the connections and if you see the outboard in the back you might better guess what I'm doing I got it hooked up to my boat uh, charger <laughs> and it's putting out a uh, 12.2 eight or nine something like that boats so it's doing what it's supposed to be doing i think the other charger is going to be going into garbage so yeah once i get that charged up i change in the spark plug and i change the air filter and we're going to see if we can get the thing started cross our fingers should i do the drink now while i'm waiting on the battery to charge yes let's do that Maybe overcook. Ice. That's enough ice. Keep 
Cheetos. Maybe they'll sponsor. Red balls. Sweat around. Sorry for the length of this video. Um, this farewell and the rate this is going might be the longest one I've ever done on the channel. No, baby, I gotta try to crank it up first. update <laughs> so it was running and I could hear what I sounded like a knock and I was like that ain't good and I checked all in this thing before I even messed with the carburetor and it was good but something happened when I took off that old carburetor and I don't know what cuz I'm told y'all I'm not much of a mechanic well when I checked all just now it didn't look right so I opened up the thing to drain it cuz I thought well Doing an oil change on the thing won't hurt. Because it's due for one, probably. Gas poured out. I was like, oh! It was like gas mixed with the oil. And so I looked it up online, and it says that that can happen with a bad carburetor, which I'm thinking, whatever I did with the old carburetor when I was messing with it, maybe caused that. So I'm going to do an oil change. And I'm going to put a little mystery oil in there to hopefully solve that knock. shouldn't say solve it. Cover it. <laughs> I don't know. If I get another year to two years out of this lawnmower, I'll be happy. Uh, especially after all this trouble. If I can just get another summer out of it at this rate, <laughs> I'll be like, oh, celebrate. But uh, yeah, so here's an oil change. Oh yeah?